Hey, it's Day Morsair. Time for another vlog type of thing. Uh, I uh, only got one thing this week, which would be this Nendoroid Totori from a game called. Uh, Atelier, Atelier, Totary, however you're supposed to say it, which is a game that I don't think has been released in the U.S., so, yeah, I don't really know anything about this character, but I like it. also comes with this thing, it's a little homunculus whatever. I don't remember what her name is, but yeah, there's that. I just, I really like all the clear parts on her clothing and stuff. Really nice Nendoroid. And I did get a card this week. Which is this one right here. It's a super rare of Gecko Moria from the fourth booster set. Which is uh, one that I was missing. Which was uh, my my uh, I traded for this with uh, Luffy gear on the YouTubes here. It's my first trade and it went pretty well. Everything went without a hitch and yeah, it was pretty successful. So yeah, I might have to do more trades in the future perhaps. But, anyways, uh, some s other stuff to talk about. Various uh, things. Like uh, this thing here. A uh, repaint of Nami that we saw a couple weeks ago. Now we have a better picture of her. And she's not too different from the uh, the original. Her top is kind of shinier. Kind of like a Lawson painting or something. But down here, you can see it says Wonder Festival 2011 Summer Event Exclusive. Uh, we all knew this was going to be exclusive some of some kind. So it's looking to be coming out in on like July 24th it says. So yeah. And moving on. Uh here's the Nendoroid Petit of Edward Elric. Saw like last week, I think. Obviously, now he's all fully painted and everything, and and uh, actually went up for pre order yesterday morning, I think. And yeah, I got him off of Big in Japan and not. Too long after that, he's sold off of there, so, uh, yeah. I th don't know if anybody else has him, but, yeah. Anyways, uh, next, we have, uh, an android of... Akemi Homura from 
that Madoka Magica show. <clears throat> so, yeah, they're definitely pumping out these now. But, in any case, I really like this one. Because... And she's kind she's kind of cool. She's not like all pink and cutesy like the other Magica Nendoroid that they've uh, put up for pre-order. But uh, this one, as you can see, comes with a handgun, which is kind of awesome and I think my mouse just died here so I'll be right back. okay now where was I uh, she comes with a handgun which is yeah pretty damn awesome and that thing so shield or something I guess and let's see here she also comes with a bazooka and a grenade which is what they're telling me that's what that is so yeah I guess whatever and she also comes with glasses and braided hair so yeah actually kind of uh waited a little too long to pre-order this and she's already sold out on Ami Ami so luckily they still had it over at HLJ she, but yeah obviously these ones are pretty popular so they tend to sell out pretty quickly here, I guess. And then here also, we've got another Madoka Magica Nendoroid, which is uh, Tomoe Mami, is her name. Yeah. Not much to say about this one at the moment, but there you go. Obviously, I don't know anything about this series, so I can't really say much about the characters or anything. Can't be like, oh my god, they're making a figure of this character. I can't believe it. Because I just don't know anything about this character. But, um, continuing on the Nendoroids... We have, uh, what's the Goto Matabe from Hyakuryoran? Again, not much to say. There it is. And Naoe Kanetsugu, also Hyakuryoran. It's kind of hard to say. And then there's uh, this, which is Elaine, or I guess is how you say it. Nendroid from Queen's Blade, two player color version. Exciting, another Queen's Blade Nendroid. Yeah, with all its uh, creepiness, what with being trying to be cute and also trying to be sexy at the same time, it really doesn't work. But, anyways, yeah, that's it for this week, so... Uh, this is Damor Sayre, and see you next time. 
when I do something else.